years ago, we were talking about s snow uh, uh, removal and icing or you know, snow plowing and laying down salt. We have uh, about a $400,000 bill facing us for a new dome to hold the salt. And, and uh, the suggestion was made, well, gee, rather than spend it, because that's a lot of money for us, why don't we use salt, uh, store our salt at a local community, somebody else that has it. Uh, and the response was, well, no, then we'd have to send our trucks, you know, four miles to get the salt. And I said, well, no, we get rid of the trucks too. Maybe we have them do our salt, our salting. So there's those kinds of things that, in regards to re regionalism, we have been a model for the county and for the state. Uh, we now currently have 12 uh, cities or villages with our Council of Governments that it runs the dispatch now, and there'll be a third one, third one, Bratinol will be coming in in January. So, and we are being used as a model. We have received many grants and awards for uh, being a forerunner in developing that regionalism and the suburban fire department has been regional and we serve six communities there so we are a leader in regional. sharing chagrin has been a very early proponent of that sharing we share equipment with Bainbridge currently uh, we have regional fire dispatch uh, also EMS and uh, I was uh, one of the founders of uh, another sharing the chagrin watershed partners uh, and that is a organization of all the communities in the Chagrin River watershed to uh, be a resource for them for uh, anything related to environmental planning, stormwater management. We've taken over all of the villages uh, stormwater reporting under the new stormwater and uh, we do that. So.